Mm, hello everyone. This is Jerome from Sinzim Bobanson Technology Company. Today, I would like to introduce you how to use our network LCD advertising display terminal and the digital signage management terminal. Okay, here we go. To begin with, we need to log in the management terminal. First, we input the login ID, then the password, finally, the server IP address. By the way, the, the server IP address should be the same as our computers. Here we can see our we can see our computer uh, IP address is 192.168.1.183 and our server IP, IP address should be the same as our computers ok we log in We are click, clicking now. Okay, here we go. We entered into the management terminal. First, we need to add a new display terminal, add a new one, then we can see the terminal properties, we need to set the general output and the network, first uh, we set the general, we need to get an IT, uh, ID name and the series number, click the next water, Add a new one. Add this water button. Then we get the ID and uh, the water button below. And get the name. Finally, we need to input the series number. Um, the series number come comes from the display unit. We can find this series number at the uh, display terminal. The sales number is uh, A. Three zero one three two eight double zero three two three. And uh, each each uh, each of our display terminal has a unique sales number. The general setting is done. Now we come to the output. Click the enabled. And choose the portrait. I have to mention that if your display terminal is a vertical version, then we need to choose the portrait. And uh, if uh, if your display terminal is a horizon version, then we need to choose the landscape. How we our display terminal is in the vertical type, so we need to choose the portrait interface. Here we choose the LVDS panel model. The panel model. Is according to your display terminal's resolution. Our display terminal 
the the resolution of all these terminal is um nine twenty plus ten eighty. So we choose the we choose the bottom this one. Then it's okay. Finally we come to the network setting. Connect the the enabled. For the net type we have three choice is that Wi Fi and Sun G and three G. How we use the Wi Fi signal so we choose new Wi Fi and I click the this button obtain an IP address automatically. Okay. Now we come to the Wi Fi setting. You need to set your Wi Fi SSID. Secure tab, which all, all secure tab is WPA2, so we choose this one. APAS secure key, input your Wi Fi secure key. Also, you can click this, click this button to show your security secure key to see if it's right. Okay. Now we save. Okay. Then we add our display display terminal. You can we can see the status. We have we have one, two, three, four, five. We have five status offline. You can see the test, the status of our display terminal is offline. So next we need to set our display terminal yeah offline. Okay. Here we go. Then uh, our you can you can see this status. Yeah, this is online. This is the online status. You can see our display display terminal is online now. Okay. Then we can program our advertising content. Look at uh, this menu, menu list. The monitor. Yeah, this is our display terminal. Element. The material that we are we are used uh, we are used we are used to create 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 the advertising content are stored in here. Let's see. Here is the program and here is the publish. Okay, we then we uh, we program a uh, advertising advertising. Okay. First, we need to add a new one. Create name. You have to give a name for your advertising. Then we name it BBC. Connect the the OK button. Okay. We choose the library. Since our display display terminal is vertical, so we choose the vertical template for it. Vertical template. Uh, we have many templates here. 
you can choose anyone you want. Now we choose this one. That is the same. Well, we need to choose the thinnest. The advertising template templates template is done. We double this, double click this. Blue error to return. First, we choose a photo, vertical photo. You can choose any photo you like. Then we choose a vertical video. Choose this video. Put it on the top. Okay, the advertising is done. We click next publish button on the left. Then you can see the publishing setup. Choose a terminal. Choose a display terminal. This is our display permit, which we connect it and uh, click to the OK. Okay. We will come to the monitor. Come to the monitor. Choose the, choose the display terminal. One can check the download log. Yeah. Here, here is the advertising that we published. You can see it's downloading now. Fif uh, Fifteen percent. We can click the refresh button. Okay, it's done. Then the advertising was uploaded to our display terminal, and then now our display terminal is playing the advertising. And our display terminal is playing advertising now. The video on the top and the photo at the bottom. Okay.
of such uh, digital signage management terminal uh, we need to set the uh, display terminal now Now we come to the display terminal configura configuration. Here we need to set the network and then the server. First, we come to the network connection. We use you are using the Wi-Fi signal, so we come to check the Wi-Fi setup. Security we use WPA2. Then input uh, your SSID, your Wi-Fi security key. Okay, we return IP address. We choose DHCP. After setting the network, then we come to the server. I have, I have to mention that the server IP address, the server IP address should be the same as our computers. Or the digital signage management terminal. Yeah. Just now, uh, we set the IP address uh, one. Nine two for our digital signage management terminal. Okay, the server setting is done. I return. Now, the setting for our display terminal is done.